All right, what is good? I'm back with another video. You guys see the screen. We on 2K23, and today we are gonna be choosing a random team to do the first rebuild of 2K23 on. So whichever team it lands on, we are gonna be rebuilding, and we have to win a championship in one year. So that that is the goal of the video, to choose a random team, and we have to win a chip in the first year. So let's see what we land on, and we get the brooklyn nets so after everything that happened this offseason we're gonna have to try to bring a championship to brooklyn so obviously i am on current gen but there has been some changes to the screen to the home screen and it looks pretty good it reminds me of 2k19 but obviously our best player we got kevin durant still on the team we got Simmons of Ben on the team who I'm trying to get rid of We are gonna be trading him. We got Warren of TJ one season wonder. I don't know how Kyrie is at 89 Ronnie, I don't know. I mean Ronnie does not even watch basketball How do you give Kyrie and Harden at 89 like they're both at least a 95? There's no way Ronnie does not watch basketball. We're gonna be trading Brick Simmons of Ben and a first round pick see who we can get First, we got Drew Holiday. I don't really like that. Isaac Okoro on Kevin Love. I do kind of like that trade because Okoro is young and Kevin Love can help us right now because he could stretch the floor for us and play the five because I don't want Nick's class in playing the five, but it looks like they do want a first round pick. I'm not going to give up a first round pick for Kevin Love, but yeah, I'm looking to get a big name center. We got De'Aaron Fox there. But we don't really need a point guard because, you know, we got already got Kyrie Irving. We don't need another ball handler. I'm trying to get an all-star center, and I'm not really liking any of these trades. So I'll see you guys when I find a trade that I like. All right, so we're here trying to trade for DeAndre Ayton. We're going to throw Simmons in two seconds. I guess it's not going to work. TJ Warren. Actually, no, I'm going to give them Edmund Summer because he's kind of a no one. And let's give him Edmund Summer. It's not going to work. And one more first round pick. So three first round picks. And that finally gets the deal done. DeAndre Ayton is now our starting center. And our team is looking pretty good. We do need some more depth though. And that's what we are. We're going to do. We're going to go make some more moves right now. Because our bench is not looking too good right now. So next. Obviously you guys see we have no more first round picks. So no more first round picks to work with. I want to trade Joe Harris and Clint Capella right off the bat. We get Clint Capella. I'm just going to go through these trades really quick. There's no shot. There's a better trade than that. We're trading Joe Harris, who's literally 99 three pointer. Can't do anything else. And Jokic's son. So now we get Capella right there. who We are going to flip again because obviously we don't need two centers. Well, let's see. Who can get Jeremy Grant right there? I really like that trade. He averaged about 19 last season. Obviously just got traded to the Blazers. But might get traded to the Brooklyn Nets now. Darren Fox gets thrown up at us again. But I'm not going to take Darren Fox. I just wouldn't see how that would work next to Kyrie. So let's go ahead and let's take that Jeremy Grant trade. Because we don't have to give up any picks. We also get Devontae Cock. And yeah, that's the starting five right now. Irving, Curry, Durant, Grant, Ayton. I think this team can win 55 games. Obviously, the bench is not too good. I'm probably going to make one more trade off the bench. Let's go ahead and trade TJ Warren because I do not really like him on this team. I'm not a big fan of TJ Warren. Throw in a second in there too. See what we can get. We've got Thibault and Matisse. We're not going to do that. At the rookie right there. Ricky Rubio. I'm looking for maybe like a power forward or just another forward. Jared Vanderbilt, I actually kind of like. Obviously, he doesn't score much, but he does bring the defense. Oh, there's Cam Johnson. We are going to do that trade. Only a second round pick. TJ Warren for Cam Johnson. Let's do that right now. And Cam Johnson will be our sixth man. So I really like that. Our team is looking way better now. We've made a lot of moves. And I think we are a championship contender now with all these moves. We are going to send a second in Cam Thomas and Patty Mills because so they're not going to play. And we get the GOAT right there, Alex Caruso. I think that will be our last trade. And, yeah, we're looking really good right now. Maybe moving to the two. 
but he goes down. So I guess he'll just play the backup point guard for us. We don't really need a backup shooting guard. And yeah, there's the rotation right there. I think this team can win 55, close to 60 games. This team is really good, has a lot of debt, has scoring, has defense. Comment down below how good you think this team is going to do. And let's go to the system proficiency. All right, so I am going to go with seven seconds. I think that will be the best for this team. I'll see you guys at the end of the season. All right, so at the end of the season, Nicole Jokic is your MVP, winning it for the third straight time, averaging almost a 30-point triple-double, 14 rebounds, 11, 11 assists. Insane numbers. Looked like he is the new Luka Doncic of 2K23. We got some new awards. Giannis, we got Trey Jones, who's most improved, and JB Bickerstaff, the Cavs coach, as coach of the year. First team, we did not get anybody. Second team, we did not get anybody. There's Harden. Nice to see Paul George making the All-NBA second team. And third team, we get Kyrie, who averaged 28 and seven. So no KD on an All-NBA team. I wonder how well of a season KD had. So let's go first to the standings like we always do. And we are the five seed as we won 50 games. I expected a bit better. We will be playing the Bulls in the first round because they are the four seed. The Cavs were the one seed with Donovan Mitchell, average 27. As always, you guys can always pause the video, take a look how every single team did. Of course, 2K did not fix anything. The number one thing I wanted to be fixed was the Pelicans, and it looks like they're still the number one seed, and it's probably going to win the NBA Finals. Durant only averaged 23. He did have six rebounds and six assists. Looks like he regressed a little bit. Seth Curry averaged 17 points. That's insane. You guys can always pause the video, take a look at the stats, and let's see the season leaders. Luke averaged 38, DeRozan averaged 31, and we will be playing him in the first round. So, let's start simming the first round as the Thunder somehow made the playoffs. So, let's simulate the first game, and we do win. We go up 2-0, pretty confident that we will win. It's 1-2, we're up 3-1, no shot with the ball, 3-1 lead taking forever to sim two to three they'll win one and it's three to three there's no way we are losing in seven not again this happens almost every single video dude rant look like he's getting too old to play only averaging 23 let's go ahead go to the rotation and let's go ahead and shorten that rotation um i want durant shooting a little more right now all right so we're here at game seven and we are gonna simcast we are up in the first quarter they take the lead it's a really close game we're up by two points at halftime Durant's leading and scoring they do take the lead in the fourth quarter they're up by five up by ten it's not looking too good one minute left and we choke cuz Durant and Irving suck Let's see the numbers they put up. Durant had 30. Kyrie had 12 points in a game seven. This is why he's at 89 overall. He kind of deserves it. Comment down below if you guys enjoyed this video. Obviously my first video of 2K23. There's gonna be a lot of videos coming. I have two new series on the way. On my career series and on my league series where I'm gonna have my own team and we're gonna be doing episodes on that. Same with the My Career series. Comment down below if you guys want to see anything else. Comment down below. As always, if you have any video ideas you guys want me to do. And I will see you guys in the next video.